Hey guys, welcome to Digit.in and in front of me we have Asus's new tough gaming series of monitor. This is the VG279QM. Um, Asus has kind of been really pushing the tough series lately over the last two years and this year we're starting to see a lot of viable alternatives to the ROG lineup coming in the tough series. So what does this monitor have? One, 27 inches of real estate, um, a resolution of 1080p which is of course it's all right it's not that bad of but what will really get you is the fact that it has a refresh rate of 280 hertz when overclocked and a fast ips panel which gives you a one millisecond response time gray to gray now of course these are pretty tall claims we'll have to actually test the monitor in order to see if it lives up to that kind of hype uh if it actually is able to deliver on those kind of specs but it is also hdr 400 certified so which means a peak brightness of 400 nits um it is G-Sync compatible, it is not G-Sync certified yet, and which is all right, as long as it's able to support uh, NVIDIA's anti-tearing uh, methodology, there's nothing really wrong with it. All in all, it's a pretty subdued monitor. It is not as, um, so Asus has this, P uh, the ROG lineup of monitors, which some tend to be fairly flashy, have this very signature design look. Uh, which is not the case with this one. This is actually pretty plain and simple. Actually, it has a lot of resemblance to the PG series of the ROG monitors. Um, let's just quickly take a look at the back and see what we have. So, of course, there is the Tough Gaming branding over here. And, yeah, you could say that it is a very cleanly designed monitor. All of the I.O. is at the bottom. You do have some ROG influence over here in this kind of design and even in the button, uh, the way the buttons are made, but that's pretty much as far as the ROG influence goes. Now, let's just quickly turn that around. So yeah, that's a quick look at the ASUS Tough Gaming VG279QM gaming monitor. No release date yet for India and no price either. Hopefully it'll be coming soon and will be priced as reasonably as the last stuff series monitors that we saw coming into the country so thank you guys for watching this video and stay tuned for more coverage from ces